Okay, so first, let's uh, let me give you a preview of our presentation today. Uh, first, Leo will introduce an overview to Huawei product documentation and will introduce some online tools, user menus, and multimedia for you, and also the ways to open this product documentation. And we'll introduce some social media accounts for further connection. At last, we will have a Q&A section. If you have any questions, you can just unmute yourself and we will answer you later. Mm -hmm. So let's start, Leo. Okay. Okay. Uh, first of all, I will give you an overview of our uh, document. Uh, as you see here in this slide, mm -hmm. uh, we have uh, Info Finder, the online tools and user manuals and multimedia videos uh, to support all your projects uh, from planning, design, installation, deployment, mm -hmm. uh, to the uh, operation and the maintenance stage. We have uh, different types of documents to yes. help you in work. Including all stages. Yeah, okay. So first of all, I will uh, introduce our info finder. This is a one-stop product information search platform. And with the Info Finder, you could find a lot of uh, useful information, including the product information, the pictures, mm -hmm. the 3D model, mm -hmm. uh, and the specifications. Uh, so I will show you uh, how to find it. Uh, how to find it? Yes, okay. first, first of all, how to find the Info Finder. So, uh, so you need to uh, remember this website uh, support dot slash enterprise Yes, our assistant have sent this address. Yeah. Oh, no, it's not this. To the uh, English version. Okay. 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 As you see here, mm -hmm. this is the front page of technical support website. Mm -hmm. And you can find Info Finder just below product support. Info Finder. This is the most popular online tool for the enterprise network. Mm -hmm. This is the home page of Info Finder. So, uh, let's choose a product first. Oh, okay. So first we need to choose one product. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so product. So which product would you like? Oh, series. Yes. I mm -hmm. want. S12700. Okay, we take this as an example. Okay. So as you see here, this uh, is a brief, uh, basic, this is the basic information about uh, S12700. Mm -hmm. As you see here, this is the uh, photo of the uh, switch and there is a brief introduction. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, and you can choose a detailed uh, model of the switch. Okay. As you see here. Yes. And if you want to, to get more photos, you can uh, use the product image gallery. With this function, you could download all the images and the visual sensors of the switch. For example, we click download. Oh, it's okay. a zip, yes. Yeah. Zip file and open it. You could find more photos wow. uh, taken from different view. Mm -hmm. for, for example, this is from the front view, right? As we have seen, yeah, and this one is from the front left, so you can get uh, more photos from different angles. Okay. Okay. Uh, this function will uh, provide you with uh, uh, product uh, photos. I I think uh, mm -hmm. a lot of customers ask me of the uh, product images, but mm -hmm. I don't have, and I mm -hmm. can't photo this uh, devices intimately so I can just send this link yeah. yes of course you share this uh, link to our, our customers and they will they can get the photos mm -hmm. okay okay and here is a, a powerful function mm -hmm. in 3d model and with this tool you could find uh, the 3d model of our product as you see here oh, it's loading wait for a moment is a little huge, yes. Yeah. Okay, as you see here, you can see our device, the, the 3D model. You can zoom in, zoom mm -hmm. out, and rotate it, mm -hmm. uh, get more detail 
more detailed information, you can zoom in and check the detail, uh, like the porch, okay, and click the right spot. Uh, you can get a brief introduction about uh, the board. More here. details, yes. Yeah. And click this, you could see the explosion view. Yeah. Okay, I see someone says, mm -hmm. I can't find the digital power product detail on main page of InfoFinder. Uh, uh, the InfoFinder now is only for the Datacom and the optical and access network products. Mm -hmm. uh, and later, we will uh, uh, help you to get uh, the digital power uh, product uh, uh, tools. tools. Yeah. Okay. okay. This is mainly about the Datacom uh, product. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. I think it's very useful and convenient for the engineers. Yeah. You don't need to take the devices with you. Mm -hmm. You can just show their show them uh, the 3D model. Yeah. Yes, the and we can just uh, I see the QR code. Yeah, and you can scan this code uh, on your mobile phone mm -hmm. and uh, show the uh, 3D model to your uh, uh, customers and uh, colleagues. Just yeah. on your own phone. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Okay, this is about the 3D model. Mm -hmm. And it, after you see our product, if yes. you want to get more detailed information, for example, the mm -hmm. specifications. Yes. Okay, you can still in info, still in InfoFinder, just click specification here, and you can get uh, the hardware, info, uh, the specifications. For example, you uh, need to select a uh, version first. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. You can choose software specification, mm -hmm. uh, modular uh, switch, for example, the card specification. Mm -hmm. and click it. You can get more information here. Mm -hmm. okay. It includes some a software specifications and also some car specifications. Yeah. Okay. okay. Uh, and in this function, feature query, as you see, if you want to compare the uh, differences uh, between uh, the between different version, mm -hmm. you could use this function specification comparison. Okay. So. So we can here. compare the specifications uh, between different uh, versions, but with the same product. Uh, yeah, with the same product. Okay, just add another version here, mm -hmm. and then we get the comparison result mm -hmm. here. If you want uh, the differences only, mm -hmm. uh, you could do comparison. No, 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 no. comparison. Oh, comparison. Okay. And another version here. You can click this, show differences only. Mm -hmm. Okay. You can get the differences only. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this is for the query specifications. Yeah. And in the hardware center, you could use this function to get the uh, hardware mapping information. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, so, so yes, I think mm -hmm. these functions are uh, for querying. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So let's move on. And this function, uh, we a uh, hardware configuration. Mm -hmm. We help you to generate a hardware configuration diagram. So first, uh, let's show me how to do the configure. Mm -hmm. okay. We have first. two methods. Yes. Yeah. So we choose the uh, the second one. Configure cars in a batch. So uh, choose the MPU first. Mm -hmm. And configure the LPU. Oh, I see value. the in the right, the devices yeah. are changing. Yeah. They are adding more, uh, bars. Mm -hmm. This is power module. Okay. As you see here, at the right side, we just generate the configuration diagram. Yeah. You can preview it. S12700 is very huge, I yeah. think. <laughs> so we get the, uh, hardware configuration diagram here. Just as your configurations, yeah. yes. That I have configured at mm -hmm. the right column, okay. the left column, okay. And you can download it. Mm -hmm. okay. 
uh, still you can use this function to calculate the power consumption, heat consumption, and weight. So click calculate. Oh, it's very quick. Yeah, we get the calculated uh, result here, like the uh, maximum power consumption, mm -hmm. the total weight here. Yeah. Is the summarized uh, consumption of the device? Yes. Mm -hmm. And you can export the results here. Okay. Yeah. I think uh, someone says mm -hmm. uh, lube size is very useful when prepared the LLD. Yeah. We design this uh, function for the LLD design mm -hmm. uh, stage. Okay. Okay. And here is the uh, download. Okay. Let's check it. The hardware configuration report. So we click it. Wow. This is the uh, board we have just configured. In the configuration list, you can see it. Mm -hmm. And here is the uh, calculate result. Like including the power consumption, the weight here. Mm -hmm. wow. And this is the diagram. It's yeah. just like the real device. Mm -hmm. Of course. Okay. So let's move on. Okay. Okay. And still in the info finder, you can use the uh, life cycle mm -hmm. function to query the uh, end of service, end of marketing time. As you see here, you choose yes. the product, the software. Mm -hmm. Okay. And you can see the Life cycle status. Yes. Okay. Uh, so with this, we don't need to ask others for mm -hmm. the life cycle. Yeah. Of And for the uh, operation and the maintenance, mm -hmm. we have uh, license control items query, uh, alarms query, uh, commands query, and the logs query. Yeah. Uh, it will help you to find the uh, uh, related information. Okay. So for they example. are just. Uh, mm -hmm. Related with this product. Yeah, only this uh, uh, switch. Mm -hmm. Okay, we have choose. For example, there is the command format mm -hmm. and the description here. You can see it. Okay. Mm -hmm. So info finder actually includes uh, every query function. Mm -hmm. I, I almost. think. Almost. Yeah, almost. Almost. <laughs> okay. Uh, but. Uh, still, we have uh, other other tools. Other you, tools. You mean yeah. we have many tools? So yeah. uh, how to find these tools? InfoFinder is just one of them, but the InfoFinder is the most powerful and the popular uh, tools among our engineers. Mm -hmm. So I uh, here is uh, here are some uh, tools on support website. Okay, you can oh, see here, here on the uh, front page of yes. support website. Mm -hmm. Click tools. You can find wow. all the tools for different uh, uh, products. Yes. So, uh, InfoFinder is for the enterprise network, right? Mm -hmm. You can find tools for digital power. Here. Yes. Someone says uh, he wants some InfoFinder for mm. digital power. Yeah. So you can find these uh, for the more tools for different products. Uh, and for the enterprise network, like mm -hmm. the, uh, our switches, mm -hmm. uh, I will rec uh, recommend you another tool. So for example, oh, we can sort by line. popularity. Yes. And this stack, uh, and as we have assistant mm -hmm. is also very popular among our switch engineers. To do the stack? To do yeah, the... it will help, uh, help you uh, more efficiently in your, uh, when you, uh, configure the stack function. Mm -hmm. So. It's very easy to use. Just uh, uh, select uh, the stack and SVF type. Uh, mm -hmm. As as uh, type, mm -hmm. for example, we choose the CSS. Okay. Okay. And choose the switch series. This one. Okay. Choose the switch name. The MPU model. Oh, I I see the photo here. Mm -hmm. uh, yes, you can click it. Oh, we to can check, check it. Yeah, check the MPU. Yes. Check the switch. Mm -hmm. Okay. CSS model. CSS card. Okay, choose the first one. Just step by step. Yeah. And after the last dive, yes. click query. Oh, you can find the precautions. Yeah. As you see, when you do the uh, stack configuration here, mm -hmm. are a lot of precautions. Yes. yes. 
So this will help you to uh, get uh, ready for the configuration. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Uh, after oh. that, we have stack by stack configure configure guide. How to do the stack? Yeah. Just oh, we don't stack. need to find others. Yeah, you don't to check the uh, documents. Mm -hmm. Just uh, with this tool, you could find all the uh, useful information. We can do you. the stack just yeah. in this one page. Yeah, just uh, use this tool, stack and as we app assistant. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's very useful. Okay. Uh, here are uh, the tools yes. I, I introduced. Okay. So let's move on. This is InfoFinder, the 3D yes. I showed you. And this is about the hardware query. Yes. The hardware the configuration. configuration to generate the diagram. Mm -hmm. uh, this is about the feature comparison. Yes. Feature query. A oh, life cycle. A uh, life cycle query. Mm -hmm. Uh, this oh, is about the yes. stack assistant, right? Okay. Right. Mm -hmm. So uh, these are tools. Yeah, these are all about our online tools. Mm -hmm. okay. So next, what do you want to introduce? Uh, of course, I want to uh, want to introduce some useful uh, documents on our support website. Yes. Okay. So uh, as you see in this slide, we have uh, uh, we have summarized a uh, lot of typical uh, scenarios and uh, configuration precautions for from our actual projects. Mm -hmm. uh, and we uh, collect all those information into our typical configuration examples and the best practice cases. Mm -hmm. So I will show you how to find these documents on our support website. I think it's very uh, important for the configuration. Mm -hmm. Course. Okay, so let's go to the support website. Enterprise support website. Okay, uh, I have showed the info finder and online yes, tools for yes. you. And in this part, you can click the switch, for example, the product name. Oh, we can choose the product yes. just under this, yes. yes. Just like the product. Mm -hmm. Okay, and here we go. You can find all the Documents. Oh, on this page. Yes. This is about the uh, documents, and uh, furthermore, you could find the knowledge base, software, download, mm -hmm. bulletins, tools, videos in this product uh, portal. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, and here are the product uh, documentation, as you see here. And uh, uh, there are more documents. You uh, for different uh, scenarios, for example, for example, if you want to learn about our products, uh, the product description, hardware description, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, feature description descriptions are recommended for you. Uh, and if you want to do some uh, installation mm -hmm. and upgrade, mm -hmm. you can find the installation guide, license guide, and uh, upgrade guide in this part. Yes. Okay. So. The left uh, mm. is divided into different scenarios. Yeah. You can find the document including your scenario. Mm. Yes. For different uh, scenarios, we have different uh, uh, types of uh, documents here. Mm -hmm. okay. As I've showed you in this part, okay, in this part, you could find the configuration examples. Oh, typical configuration, configuration examples. examples. Yeah, these uh, documents are very popular and very useful for our uh, engineers. Typical configuration examples. Mm -hmm. We just follow the examples and we can com configure our uh, devices, our network. Yeah, for example, we have the campus network uh, uh, configuration examples. Mm -hmm. Yes, and this, uh, and this uh, configuration examples are, are classified according to the features. Yes. Yeah, you can see it here. For example, oh, for different features. Yeah. For example, configure the MPLS and the VPN, mm -hmm. IP service, mm -hmm. multitask, things like that. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you just said best practice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. For that. Uh, you could find best practices. Uh, at this part, I showed you still on the support website. 
quick technos. Technos, what's technos? Uh, technos are the short technical documents that generally describe specific problems mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. solutions. Uh, you can find uh, the technos for our switches, uh, campus switches, data center switches, routers. And at the, at the last part, mm -hmm. you can find the best practices for different uh, uh, products here. Best practices. For the switches, for yeah. campus. Yeah, you could find the best practices here. Okay. So it is from the real product. Mm, yes, of course. So we can follow this yeah. um, practice to do our best practice. Yeah. This will help you to finish the uh, configuration. Okay. okay. This is about the configuration, configuration. I think. Okay. Okay. So still on mm -hmm. support website, mm -hmm. we have uh, the encyclopedia. So what that? Uh, 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 in the IP encyclopedia, we have uh, uh, we have create uh, different uh, 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 technical terms, mm -hmm. in, including the IPv6, mm -hmm. SLV6. Uh, with this uh, IP encyclopedia, uh, you could get a brief understanding of our technology in a few minutes. For example, the SLV6. So after reading this article, mm -hmm. we will have a brief understanding of the yeah. technology. So how about for a deeper Understanding. Uh, for deeper understanding, we have uh, our uh, IP network ebooks. Uh, ebooks. Yeah, ebooks. Support right on the e.huawei.com. Yes. And you can find the as the homepage of our product. Yeah. Click IP network ebook series. A uh, hot topics. Uh, yes. Hot topics. So you can see our ebooks here. So we have uh, ebooks for campus network, mm -hmm. IPv6, enhancement innovations, and data center networks. So uh, uh, these ebooks are more uh, profound than the IP encyclopedia articles. Yes. Uh, it will take you hours to uh, get a brief. Uh, understanding of the solution or technology. Uh, actually, we have uh, printed some So e it is not a hard, mm. hard, yes. Yeah, we have hard printed, cover. we have printed some ebooks, you can see it here. Yeah. For example, the Wi-Fi 6, as you see, uh, the book is not very, uh, think. yeah. Not very thick. It will take you maybe uh, a couple of hours to finish this book to get a, a deeper understanding of Wi-Fi six. And you can see many pictures, some network pictures, some diagram, and so on. Mm -hmm. You can just have a deeper understanding of the technology. Yeah. You can download uh, the. Uh, electronic version on our website. Yes, we have. How many ebooks do we have? Uh, almost uh, twelve. Actually. Twelve. Yeah, twelve ebooks we uh, we have uploaded. So we are and, updating. Uh, yeah, still we are up, uh, updating the ebooks, mm -hmm. uh, and almost every month we will upload two or three ebooks to our website. Yeah. Okay. So. Uh, we have the electronic format on the website. Yeah. And this is, uh, these are printed. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. So they are free. Of course. Okay. And actually, we have another uh, edition which is uh, not free. You can wow. uh, find it on our on the Amazon. Uh, this is called the Data Communication Series uh, books. Uh, these uh, books will help you to get a uh, uh, more uh, deep understanding of our technology and uh, solutions. I think if I uh, read it, I will become an expert. expert of course. <laughs> yes. <laughs> this book will take you months or years to 
I'll finish. Yes, <laughs> it's very difficult for me, I think. <laughs> okay, let's okay. go on. So I think there are all um, mm. books or mm. some documentations for study. Mm. Mm. Yes. Yeah. So uh, I don't want to read some words. Do we have some videos? Uh, yes, we have a lot of videos on our support website. Uh, so let me show you. Support website, still a support website. Okay. You can find online courses. Courses, yeah, yes. Just besides InfoFinder. Mm -hmm. This is the InfoFinder I showed you. Mm -hmm. And this is our course. Okay, click it and choose a product here. For example, the campus switches. Okay. Okay. Oh, now you can see the uh, videos, videos here. Mm -hmm. We have different types of videos. For example, the product introduction, mm -hmm. uh, the feature introduction videos, the network deployment videos, including how to uh, uh, install the hardware mm -hmm. and the basic device configurations. Okay. So we actually provide different formats, reading or watching. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. This is, this is about the videos here. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, so I have showed you the books here, the documents. Oh wow, what's this? I think it's very important because yeah. many people ask me <laughs> the NCE documents, yes, right? Do you have some documents for NCE? Of course, we have uh, documents for NCE. Just uh. On the support website, uh, just close to switches. Mm -hmm. Here, you can see network management control and analysis. Mm -hmm. So in this page, you could find all the uh, NCE types and mm -hmm. click one. For example, the NCE uh, campus. Dash campus. Okay, mm -hmm. NCE campus. You could find the NCE campus documents here, just like uh, uh, yes, the it's very yeah. similar. Mm -hmm. You can find, uh, for example, uh, you can find uh, best practices. Oh, they have pra best practices too. Yeah, and the configuration guide here. Okay, and okay. Uh, still they have, I think they have videos. Uh, they have also have videos. Yes. And he uh, and uh, we have infographics for the uh, license uh, for the license. Mm -hmm. You can see here. The different license. Yeah, the license guide. Yeah. For different scenarios, I mm. see. Yeah. Yes. yes. Okay. So that's uh, user manuals for the NCE. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Oh, I mo almost forgot uh, one important function of our HADEX. Uh, HADEX? Forget to introduce what? our HADEX. Okay. So let's just go let's back to it. the Support the website, page. okay. The product documentation here. Mm -hmm. For example, you can see this one is different from others. This is Hadex. called uh, uh, Hadex 2.0. Yes. This is the new version of Hadex. So in this uh, format of documents, mm -hmm. uh, you can find more powerful function here. For example, you can the key uh, information, uh, key uh, function mm -hmm. of Hadex 2.0. Is to customize document. So click this. You one. mean customize yeah. the document? Yeah. Oh, I just. Uh, you don't. You like, need to log in. I need to log in first. Okay. Maybe just. I need this one. Customize. Okay. Just customize part of the article. Oh yes. Okay. We can so, customize the document. Yeah. For example, you can. Uh, Edit the, the, name? Cha uh, the chapter name. For yes. Example, safety description. Okay. Just uh, I just re-added the chapter name, mm -hmm. and uh, you can also delete part of the uh, documents. As you see, our document size is uh, very is large. large. Yes. It's uh, not easy to share it with others. Yes. So if you just want to keep part of the information, just click the delete. icon, mm -hmm. click delete, 
Okay. Sure, I want yeah. to delete. Okay, you delete everything, I think. <laughs> I need to go back. Okay, here we go. Yes. Okay, and click finish. Oh, no, not including. No third party. Yes. Switch the page. We rename it. Okay. Okay. Let's click it. So you can download the customized uh, document here. So it is, oh, it is in PDF format. Yeah, it's in PDF format. Yeah. This is the document we have just customized. Okay. We have deleted some chapters, right? We have re-added this uh, chapter name. So uh, if you want just some uh, mm -hmm. topics of our documentation, you can just use this function. Yeah. So this is a Hadix 2.0. Mm -hmm. version of Hadix. Okay. Okay, so mm -hmm. what else do you want to introduce next? Uh, okay, I will show you some. Uh, let's see. Okay, this is about the Happy Encyclopedia. Yes. Ebooks. Yes. And the books. The books. Mm -hmm. Data communication books. Okay. And this is about the online courses. Videos. The videos yes. So let's move to the next part, how to find all the uh, documents. As I've showed you, yes. most of the uh, videos, manuals, and tools uh, can be obtained from our support website. Yes, true. Yeah. And still we have other ways. For example, we have the uh, Hino app. Hino app? Hino app. You can scan this QR code to download Hino. It's uh uh it's on your on the smartphone. Mm -hmm. uh, after download it, you could find uh the videos, the documents, and the tools on uh in Hino app. Mm -hmm. And here is a key uh, function of Hino is to uh, scan the barcode of mm -hmm. our device, mm -hmm. and you could guide the maintenance status, uh the documents, the videos about the device. Oh, I think. It it's is the scan function. Yes, it is offline or just online. It's uh, online. You it's need, online. Yeah. Yes. You need to connect the network first. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Okay. You can scan this QR code to try it. It's very convenient for you to uh, get the information on your mobile phone. Yes. Okay. If it is not convenient for you to scan this QR code now, we can just mm -hmm. uh, send exactly. the slides to you after the meeting. This is the Hano app, mm -hmm. and uh, the other uh, way to get our documents is just uh, Google it. Okay. For example, Google, it's Google. Yes. yes. Just input uh, Huawei. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Menu. Oh, no, 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 it's not menu. It's not double and Yes. So you can find the Google result here. Yes, it's the first one. Yeah. So click it. You can oh, find the product uh, the same photo. Page. Yeah. Yes. And here are the documents here. Okay. It. Maybe it's more convenient for someone. Yeah. For uh, so uh, if you. Don't remember the support.huawei.com slash e, so you can just uh, Google the product uh, mm, name yes. plus the menu or the yes. uh, document, but, and you can uh, find it. Yes, I think it is, it, you must remember the website. <laughs> the website. Yes. It's not very difficult to remember the yes. website, I think. Yes, support.huawei.com slash e. Very easy. Yes, it's very easy. Okay. So, uh, social media accounts? Yeah. Uh, actually, we have uh, opened a lot of social media accounts mm -hmm. uh, uh, of our own uh, Huawei documentation. Mm -hmm. So you can find us on Facebook, LinkedIn, and YouTube. Mm -hmm. Just search Huawei documentation insights. Uh, for example, on the YouTube. 
the same name, yeah. the same account. You can find our documentation channel. Just search Huawei Documentation Insights. Okay. Yeah, this is our wow, official the channel. The first one is on a beautiful YouTube. lady. Okay. You can find a lot of videos. Wow. Hello, everyone, and welcome. For example, the Huawei IP not IP Tech Talk. Mm -hmm. uh, this series of vid uh, videos are mainly about the Wi-Fi Six. Mm -hmm. You can just watch the videos here or on the support website. Yeah, it's the same. Okay. Yes, mm -hmm. Not the same. You can choose the way you like. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you can find us on the social media and mm -hmm. to get the uh, latest uh, documentation information. Yes. So, uh, do we have any other way to subscribe the Huawei documentation? Uh, of course, on the support website. On the support website. The support website. Oh, I almost forgot this. Uh, if you have any. Question about our website mm -hmm. or uh, documents? Just click uh, feedback to leave a message by email mm -hmm. or leave the message on the uh, documents. Okay? Yes. And here is the newsletter. Uh, subscribe our newsletter. You can get the latest uh, product uh, documentation information. So just uh, uh, choose the product you are interested in yes. and input your email mm -hmm. and click join and oh. click this yeah, one click this one yeah. yes the, pri the privacy policy okay. yes is very important <laughs> and input your email address mm -hmm. it's very easy for you to subscribe our newsletter can you show us some newsletters uh, oh uh, yeah so on the support website okay click this one Mm -hmm. Enterprise Network. Here are the latest newsletters we have sent to the to the subscribers. For example, for example, we have the collection of our troubleshooting guide. So after subscribing us, you will get some emails. Yeah, once a week. Once, once a, a week. week. Yeah. Okay. Almost once a week. For example, the and the collection of best practices. Mm -hmm. uh, the new function introduction. Of info finder and uh, configure the collection of configuration guides here. Mm -hmm. I think with this, uh, you will you won't miss any anything. Yes. <laughs> okay. This is about uh, the uh, new slider. And okay. subscribe us, mm -hmm. please. Mm -hmm. Okay. So. So okay. This is about uh, the. Q and A section. Yeah, this is about the Q and A section. Do you have any questions about our website, menus, and videos? Any questions? So, do you guys have ever known about these tools or some documentations before? Is Hadex 2.0 working for Mac OS X? Is there a tool or web paging a page mm -hmm. where I can compare the technical specifications? Uh, actually, mm -hmm. uh, the Hadex 2.0 is just for the online use. Mm -hmm. uh, it has nothing to do with the uh, operation system. Mm -hmm. But if you want to install the Hadex Lite, you mm -hmm. know, it's only for the uh, micro, uh, for the Windows system. Mm -hmm. Okay, the second problem, mm -hmm. is there a tool or web page where I can compare the technical specifications of the products for pre-sales? Uh, you need to use the ICT tool. Mm -hmm. ICT, uh, you can find them on the, you can find the tool on the, on idahoy.com. The 
to boot. Sure. Not this one. You need to log in first, and you can. Uh, after that, you can uh, get the permission to the SCT tool. You can just search it. Search it. SCT. Okay. Oh, the this, quotation tool SCT yeah, yeah. Uh, is a training video. Uh, but yeah. there is, a, I think there's a link. A guide. Is a guide. Yeah. Or click anyone, you could find, find the, the link, link to SCT tool. Mm -hmm. This SCT. Or maybe we can just send the link after mm -hmm. the meeting to yeah. you. Okay. I will send you the SCT tool link. Okay. Okay. So mm -hmm. next. When digital power will be included in info part, I think is in info, info finder. finder. Uh, I will uh, record this requirement mm -hmm. to our development engineer colleague. Mm -hmm. uh, I think uh, maybe later they will develop the uh, info finder or just uh, like this info finder tool for the digital power. Okay. Yes. Now they, they actually don't have the info finder for the digital power. Uh, products. Okay. Yes, it seems like InfoFinder is very useful, powerful, mm. so everyone wants this. Yes. Yeah. So, uh, any any other question? Hadex Lab Two extension available. Mm. What's this? Oh, this is the ICT tool. This oh. link is as easy to. You also can. Yeah. Uh, Hadix Light, uh, oh, oh no, Hadix Light is only for our, uh, Chrome extension available, uh, not available yet. Uh, you need to, uh, install the Hadix Light on your, P uh, uh, personal computer first. So it is an application. Yeah. You need to download it. Download it and install it. Okay. Let's check the link. Oh, the link in the box, in the message box is the link to SCT. Sorry, I missed your answer. Uh, sorry, I missed your answer. So, um, we are planning maybe. Uh, Mm, actually, they don't have a roadmap uh, mm -hmm. for the digital power product. So maybe they have their own tool, mm, mm, yeah. like the info finder. Yeah. They, they, they will develop another tool like info finder for digital power. Okay. okay. Let's check it. Digital power. Um, actually, you can find some tools for digital power, like the uh, UPS assistance or others. Leo can show us. Mm -hmm. so So if you want the information for digital power, so you can choose the uh, product first in this part. Mm -hmm. And if you want the tools here, click this and digital power. Yeah. Uh, they do have some assistant tools, uh, but not like, a, not a tool like InfoFinder right now. Yes. Uh, he says, yes, we know this part, mm -hmm. but sorry. They don't have info finder now. <laughs> yes. Uh, maybe they will, uh, provide someone like the something like info finder later mm -hmm. in the future. But now is, is, is not including. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Okay. Okay. Any questions?
Okay, thanks. We will wait for it. Okay, thank you. Thank you for your waiting. Oh, I almost forgot to introduce the community. Oh, community. Yeah. If you have any questions about uh, uh, our product uh, and uh, document, mm -hmm. you can uh, post your question on the forum. Example. You can, you can just, just ask for help. Could you ask for help? Wow. And just write your question here mm -hmm. uh, and post it. Uh, our engineers and uh, uh, the engineers uh, from all around the world mm -hmm. will see your uh, post and uh, will give you an answer. In the forum, for example. Okay. Oh, we have yeah. different parts. Yeah, just uh, choose a product and and post click post sharing click. you yeah. can just sharing your way to solve the problem yeah. okay so someone mm -hmm. says is there any difference between ICS and HADAX uh, yes of course uh, actually the ICS is uh, is the new version for HADAX uh, as you see he, uh, uh, as you see the HADAX will End of service at the end of the year, mm -hmm. so we need to use uh, ICS to uh, yes to mm -hmm. extend the uh, headaches. Let's show it. Show them. Okay, so on the support website you can find ICS. Please remember ICS because the headaches is That's right. yes. Right. Is going end of service. It, you can find a brief introduction mm -hmm. uh, of the ICS slide, and you can uh, download it. It's just like the HIDAX. You can read the documentations offline. You can manage your documents. This is ICS Lite. It's more useful than HeadX, I think. Mm, almost. <laughs> almost, okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, as you see, it's, the new, uh, it's just the first version of ICS Lite. Mm -hmm. I think there are some uh, bugs, you know, but we are fixing it. Okay, you, mm. uh, if but you find have... bugs, you can just leave the message yeah. to us. Oh. Maybe you will get some gifts. <laughs> I'm not sure whether this presentation covers this question, but do you have any online tools that we can make practice like Cisco Packet mm. Tracer? Yeah, we are now, uh, actually now we don't have uh, similar tools, but we, we are working on it. And maybe months later, we will have uh, a tool like the simulator. Okay, so yeah. please wait for us. Yeah, not, uh, we are, uh, we are developing this tool. Mm -hmm. Okay. Actually, the Chinese version is online and the English version will be online. Mm, Maybe month later. Month later. Yeah. Yes. Waiting for it. Thanks. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you for waiting. And on the, uh, com in the community, you could find a lot of, uh, activity. For example, wow. uh, we are holding the, Activity for our IP network ebooks. Just uh, give your uh, suggestion about the ebooks, and you can get a gift. Yeah. You have chance to get the gift. Yeah, <laughs> you have the chance. <laughs> Just read the books and give, uh, leave your feedback, and you have the chance to get a gift. So we have a lot of. Activities like this. Yeah, in the for in the community, every month we have a lot of uh, activity in the community. Also, we have Turkey Technical Forum. Yeah, we have the Turkey. Yes. Support community. Yes. Welcome to uh, our welcome our partners to participate. Maybe you can find the same problem you have made, I mm -hmm. think. Mm -hmm. 
like how to upgrade to a partner account. Mm -hmm. Yes. So if you have any question about the account, I think you can just uh, find it on our support website. So here, here, help, you can find something about the account, yeah. the feedback or something. Yeah, how to upgrade your account. Yes. How to renew your account, you can find the account guide here. And also something else. Mm -hmm. I think uh, I think they are very activity, yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, they are very active. Actively. Yes, so uh, maybe you will send many gifts. Yeah. <laughs> of course, we have prepared a lot of gifts yes. for those who ask questions or give uh, suggestions in mm -hmm. our training. Thank you for our partners who yes. have given Feedback. feedback yeah. Yes. Or problems, questions. Mm -hmm. And we are very glad to see this. Yeah. So let's wait for another question. Or uh, if you have, if you don't have any question, maybe uh, it's time to say goodbye. Yeah. So, any other questions? Oh, thank you very much for your camp support and the valuable information. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Thank you for your high price. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Please uh, share the document. Of course, we will send the slides and also these records. Yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you for you guys. Okay. Thank you, everyone. This is all about our training today. Yes. Goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you all.